Holy shit, a video clip that was recorded with something other than my desktop. Yes, this is in fact my PC. I went with a Lee and Lee O11 Dynamic, so I figured since I have this case, I'm just going to bling the fuck out of it with nine RGB fans and just go fucking wild. I'm going to talk about how I did that without the use of the Corsair Commander Pro. I did not use that to do this, and I am not going to open the side panel of my case to show you how I hooked it up because I don't even know if I'd be able to. I don't even know if I'd be able to get the fucking panel back on, and I don't even think it'd be worth it to open it to show you because there's an abyss of cords back there, and I, you probably wouldn't even be able to tell how the fuck I hooked it up anyway, so I'm going to go back to the desktop recording here and just talk about how I went about doing it. So I already had this right here, the IQ Lighting Node Pro, I already had that, and one of these RGB fan hubs. So as you can see, the Corsair Commander Pro is 75 bucks. it's pretty pricey, at least to me, because I'm cheap as shit, and I like to save money whenever possible. So all I did was I purchased one more of these, and then I had to ask Corsair for the cable that actually goes to this in order to connect the fan hub to the Lighting Node Pro to the second slot here. They don't charge you anything for that. They'll ship it out to you for free. It just kind of sucks that it doesn't come with it by default because it doesn't really make sense that it wouldn't. But oh well, they aren't going to charge you for it. They'll ship it out to you for free. It only takes a few days. It's not a huge deal. So then once I got it, I connected the cable from the fan hub to Lighting Node Pro to the second slot here, hooked up uh, the remainder of my fans in the order that I wanted and then uh, connected the SATA cables that I needed to and that was really about it. That's all I had to do. I did not have to go and purchase a Commander Pro for 75 bucks because if you already have one of these hubs and you have a Lighting Node Pro, you don't need the Commander Pro. You can literally go to Corsair's page, buy this for $10, and then just ask them to ship you out the cable that's needed to connect to the Lighting Node Pro. It's pretty easy, you just have to wait a couple days, but it's it's gonna save you $60, $65. And in my opinion, it's worth it. So that's how I hooked it up. That's uh, really about it. So I was actually confused at first because I wasn't able to find a way to do it until I experimented on my own. From all the other YouTube videos that I saw, it, it made it seem like you had to use the Commander Pro. Well, that's simply not the case. All you need is one of these uh, Lighting Node Pros two of these uh, fan hubs and then the two cables that connect the fan hubs to the lighting node pros in each of these slots. That's all you need and then you just have to hook up your fans. You'll probably need splitters like I said but that's really about it and it will work perfectly and it'll save you some money. So hopefully that helps you guys out in case you're trying to figure out how to hook it up and make it all work without the Commander Pro. All right thanks for watching. Take it easy guys.